Hey guys, Chip here. Today I want to do a real quick video showing you how to create a knurled texture on the side of a knob. So let's get started. Shift A, Mesh, Circle, and I want to set this to about 128. I want a very fine circle. I'm going to tab into that circle and I'll hit A and F to fill it and then E to extrude it up to about the height of the knob and then Control B to, to bevel it. And when I bevel it, I want to bevel it an even number. So I'll go Let's see, five, six, six segments, and maybe something like that. Okay, and then I'll tab back out of it. I'll go into my kit ops and I'll load my um, synth plastic paint. By the way, this material kit, all these materials are going to be CCO free. So I'll get those out when the synth gets launched. It's exciting, a lot of good materials there. So I'll add material to that. And there's our material, right click, shade smooth. Let's go over to our normals and set that up. So there is our knob. Now I'm gonna go into the local mode and let's look at the side view in orthographic and I'll go into a wireframe mode, tab into this, control R. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep rolling the mouse until I get these roughly about a square. So let's see, and I also want an even number. I'm gonna go with 20, now let's go down. 18 looks good. So now I've set that up and you can see what I'll do is I'll tab into this, go into my face select mode and let's just select all of these and all these areas that we're going to want to knurl. Actually, let's get this bottom one too. Then with these selected, I'm going to hold the shift key down and hit H and it's going to hide everything else. And let's go back into solid mode. And the first I'll do is I'll say face and poke faces. And with it selected like this, I'll hit Control J, which is also face and tries to quads. And look what it does. It actually makes this little nice triangle pattern. And with that selected, I'll say face, poke faces again. And let's go to the top view here. And let's just move those neural patterns out just a little bit, something like this. So this is gonna give us our neural pattern and then Alt H is gonna bring us back into uh, unhide all the other stuff that we have. And then I'm gonna hit the tab or the uh, the numpad uh, backslash to get us here and tab out of it. And you can see now we have a very nice knurled knob. Let's just for the heck of it, go in and add the synth metal and I'll get some st synth steel mat, add material. And you'll see that that works really well. So I hope this was helpful. It's a kind of a quick little hack, but it, I think it works pretty well. Thanks for watching. See ya. Bye.